Kochi's Rajagiri School of Engineering and Technology, also known as RSET, is an autonomous college located in Trivandrum, which is affiliated to APJ Abdul Kalam Technological University. It has been given an overall rating of 3.7 out of 5 by students on Chiksha.com. But how is the BTEC program here? Let's find out in this detailed college review, starting with the 3.8 star rated placements. As per the data available on NIRF, out of the total 629 graduated students, 393 were placed, resulting in a 60. 2.48% placement rate. A quick look at the year-on-year -year data reveals that RSET is not doing all that well when it comes to being able to place more of its batch than it could earlier with placement rates falling in the last two years by almost 24%. The median salary offered at RSET during the 2022-23 placement drive was 5.1 lakh per annum. Again, a look at the year-on-year -year trend in the median packages from 2021 to 2023 shows an healthy improvement of 13% in the last one year and 27% improvement over the course of the last two years. Comparing the median packages of RSET with neighbouring and similarly ranked Tamil Nadu's RMD Engineering College, you will see that the median salary in RSET is marginally higher than that of RMD. A number of eminent companies such as Bosch, Cognizant, Infosys and Alliance visited during the placement drive and also offered roles such as that of web developer, software engineer. Students shared that since the college is in the vicinity of an info park, this gives tremendous locational advantage to students. Talking about internships, mostly 90% students got internships in new enterprises or startups with a selective few getting opportunities at companies such as Hitachi, Hexaware and Tech Mahindra. A large percentage also received internship with Kochi Shipyard. RSET offers students a variety of options from its bouquet of engineering courses consisting of 9 BTEC specializations with a total intake of 840. An interesting fact is that the university also offers a specialization in computer science and business systems in collaboration with TCS. Additionally, Artificial Intelligence and Data Science is a relatively new program that was introduced in 2020-2021 after this college got its autonomous status. Admissions to RSET are based on Kerala's state-level entrance exam, which is KEAM, with a prerequisite of 45% aggregate score in 10 plus 2. Examining the year on your trend in closing cutoffs reveals a consistent upward movement, leading to intensified competition levels across many specializations, particularly in computer science and AIDS. Surprisingly, competition in civil engineering has seen an easing out. Comparing the closing cutoff ranks with RMD Engineering College, it is evident that RSET is the preferred choice of students, especially for ECE and IT branches with practically a 2x difference. Speaking of the cost, the per annum tuition fee year is Rs 95,000, adding up to the sum of around 3.8 lakhs for four years. Let's switch gears to infrastructure and see what students are saying. The infrastructure at RSET features modern facilities to support academic and extracurricular activities. The campus includes spacious classrooms, well-equipped laboratories, a vast library with extensive resources, sports facilities and comfortable accommodation option for students. Meanwhile, college provides first-class hostel facilities separately for both boys and girls. Hostels are also said to be offering two- and three-bed sharing rooms with and without attached bathrooms. Despite having good infrastructure, some concerns have been raised about the hostel wardens. Students have reported that the wardens can sometimes come across as strict and unapproachable. Students have also reported a strict hostel curfew with no exceptions even for medical emergencies. Both wedge and non wedge options are available for students, but the food provided in the college canteen and hostel mess is said to be average in terms of taste and hygiene. There are some restrictions on the Wi-Fi usage. It is unavailable for students in the academic block unless required specifically for educational purposes. In addition, not all hostel rooms have Wi-Fi connectivity. The college offers a vibrant sporting culture boasting of two basketball courts, a football ground, a badminton court and a cricket ground. Meanwhile, the medical facilities are reported to be good. When it comes to the transportation, the college provides bus facilities to and from the hostel for girls. Additionally, the college provides transportation facilities to nearby cities and towns to both the faculty and the students. Shifting gears now to faculty and course curriculum, which has received 3.9 stars from students. Students share that the meticulously crafted curriculum prioritizes current topics and excludes outdated or obsolete content. Rajagiri has its own curriculum given its autonomous status and this is better than KTU syllabus share students. Meanwhile, teachers are said to be highly qualified, helpful with a vast experience in their respective fields. Students also share that semester exams are tough. Pass percentages vary for different branches. Now let's move on to campus life 
Chennai, where RSET has received 3.6 stars here. As part of the extracurricular activities, the college provides students with different clubs for arts, sports, debate, and literary pursuits. It also provides seven branch associations to carry out various sports activities. In addition, the college also holds a two-day cultural fiesta, an annual sports event, and tech fests. Students share that active participation can be seen at these events. Finally, the NIRF ranking. RSCT has not been ranked in the 2023 rankings. The last time it was ranked was in 2022, where it was placed between 201 to 250. So this is the review of RACT. For more details on this college or to check out thousands of course and college reviews, visit shiksha.com. We'd like to hear from you, so do drop in a comment below and do not forget to like and share this video.